everyone today we are going to talk about the benefits of aloe vera ouch this ow really hi everyone welcome to discovery natural today we are talking about the benefits of aloe vera in your hair and the dangers of using aloe vera if you've not yet subscribed to our channel please do subscribe because we show you valuable information that will be helpful for your hair and for your children's hair and we also bring out videos every week that will help you do that and achieve your natural hair goals so that's why you need to subscribe for those that have subscribed already thank you so much and we hope to see you on our other social media outlets today we are talking about aloe vera and what is aloe vera well aloe vera right now it is like trending when I say move over coconut welcome aloe vera you guys know what I'm talking about a lot of people are using aloe vera on their hair and they're using aloe vera in so many ways and some ways are beneficial and some ways are not so beneficial and today I'm giving you the download dirty information about this aloe vera plant this magical plant that everybody is just going out to buy and going out to put on their hair aloe vera is excellent for the hair it has a lot of benefits for your hair even digesting aloe vera has benefits for your body now some of the benefits is that aloe vera contains natural enzymes and this enzyme they actually help you to repair like dead skin cells that are in your scalp and that's why this aloe vera is good for dandruff it helps in getting rid of dandruff when used correctly and it also helps you in your hair so when you apply things like aloe vera gel in your hair it helps to make your hair shiny and it helps to make your hair smooth another thing that aloe vera does is that it conditions the hair making it an excellent moisturizer later on i will be showing you some treatments that you can use in terms of how using aloe vera in hair growth so aloe vera has a lot of benefits in also promoting hair growth reducing hair loss in your hair and that is why a lot of people benefit from using aloe vera now there are times that aloe vera is useful and there's times that aloe vera can actually be damaging your hair we'll talk about that but let me tell you about some of the treatments that you can use in terms of using aloe vera gel or aloe vera juice or aloe vera the plant straight from your garden or from the supermarket where I got this because I tried to grow aloe vera and my aloe vera never grew so I just bought this for a dollar fifty at the supermarket so what are some treatments that you can use some recipes that you can use aloe vera for so the easiest way to use aloe vera and this is one way that a lot of people are using it right now is as a pre pool a pre pool is a pre-treatment that some people are be using for their hair before they go and wash their hair pre poo is usually using oils okay for your hair but some people like using aloe vera and if you like using aloe vera and it works for you what do I say I always say do you boo so do you if that works for you so what people do is that they take aloe vera and they cut up the plant okay and then they take the gel from the plant and they slather it in their hair cover their hair maybe sleep overnight with it and that is how they pre put their hair they condition their hair before they wash their hair so that's one way the second way that some people do is use it as a conditioner when you use it as a conditioner i usually prefer using it in terms of taking aloe vera gel or if you are more into the all natural things you can take this aloe vera take the scoop the gunk you know the jelly part from it you mix it four ounces of that and you mix that with four ounces of water when you do that you create a liquid conditioner this liquid conditioner can also help you if you have itchy scalp you can use it to heal your itchy scalp what you do is this you spray the conditioner onto your hair you can leave it in your hair but you can also rinse it out after a couple of minutes 
the other way that some people use aloe vera is to use it as a dandruff reducer or dandruff remedy so what you do is that you take the aloe vera the jelly part again and you mix it you kind of blend it and you mix it with peppermint oil this can be applied to the scalp once or twice a week and left in your hair for about 10 minutes when you do that after you left it in your hair for 10 minutes then you want to proceed and rinse it out giving your scalp a nice condition and giving your scalp a nice pH balanced atmosphere for your hair to grow healthy one thing about using this as an humectant as a cuticle closer what you can do is you can actually use aloe vera juice so now using aloe vera juice after you wash your hair cold aloe vera juice will help close the cuticles now when you close your hair cuticles what it does is that it leaves your hair shiny and it leaves your hair feeling smooth so that might be the last thing you want to do after washing your hair is to apply some aloe vera juice on your hair to help close the cuticle and also help you control freezing your hair so now let's talk about the not so nice part about aloe vera the most obvious one is of course the prickly sides over here when you use aloe vera you have to be very careful with using it make sure you shave off or you cut off the prickly part because what can happen is that if you use aloe vera plant directly on your scalp like rub it in there the prickly part can actually cut your scalp so that is the most obvious danger be careful when using this because the prickly part yes it's gonna stab you in the finger which it has done me and my daughter so many times but you have to be careful with that the next danger that we have in terms of using aloe vera in your hair is to know that aloe vera is an humectant okay in the atmosphere that you use aloe vera some people they find that when they use aloe vera in putting some particular atmosphere it actually dries their hair out so you have to understand when and how to use aloe vera in the right atmosphere and the right climate so if you find that when you're using aloe vera your hair feels much drier than it was before you use aloe vera please 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 stop using it it's not worth it because what will happen is that dry hair will transfer to hair that breaks the third reason why i feel that you shouldn't be using aloe vera so much and i feel that you need to educate yourself before using aloe vera is that you have to understand when you use the aloe vera from the plant you strain it well you have to strain it well if you don't strain it well what will happen is that the residue you know the white residue that comes from using the aloe vera can actually attract dirt so it will attract dirt into your hair and it will also cause you to have dandruff so you will be more prone to have dandruff defeating the purpose of using the aloe vera in the first place the final reason that i feel i'm giving you a fourth reason now is that when you understand the use of aloe vera and when you understand that aloe vera sometimes isn't the best friend for low porosity hair you know that you have to be so careful when you use aloe vera when you have low porosity hair now if you don't know your porosity you can click that card that just popped up to understand how to know your hair porosity my hair porosity is medium low so sometimes when i use aloe vera it's a hit or miss for me so what does aloe vera juice or aloe vera products do to hair that has low porosity now with low porosity hair you have to be very careful because it can actually have a lot of build up air products can build up on your hair more and you can also have what is known as aloe vera build up or aloe build up when you have aloe build up that is when the aloe product has built up so much on your hair cuticles causing it to be dry causing it to be break to be brittle and causing breakage in your hair so when you use aloe vera always research 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 as i always say you have to research before you start using something don't just say this person used it and that person used it so i'll just use it understand your hair understand that aloe vera is a good ingredient is a good natural product for remedies like itchiness and dandruff 
but you have to know how it works in your hair and how not to use it and how to use it so thank you so much for watching this video if you guys like this video please give me a thumbs up let me know do you use aloe vera and if you do comment below I want to know how do you use aloe vera if you want me to try this aloe vera and show you more remedies that I've used in the past please comment below and I'll give you a video showing this remember we are available to you on Instagram on Facebook and even on our Twitter account so make sure you check us out there see you guys in the next video thanks for watching bye, bye.